If you are looking to be an engineer or scientist, you definitely do not want to skip this video. The equation written down below here is an equation for voltage. Rather than just plugging in numbers, which I trust that you can do, instead I want you to try and prove that the equation provided calculates volts. K is the constant given in this diagram. The units are newtons times meters squared divided by coulomb squared. The next thing I need to do is take these units and multiply it by Q. Q represents a charge which is measured in coulombs typically. So we have K times Q, and I'm gonna divide this whole thing by R, which is a distance in meters. I immediately notice that the coulombs here will cancel with one of the coulombs on bottom of this fraction. I also notice that the meters down here will cancel with one of the meters on top. Newtons times meters, that's work, and work is measured in joules. And of course, we'll keep the bottom of the fraction the same, but notice how we have joules per coulomb, and joules per coulomb is equal to volts. And we just proved that this equation calculates volts. The reason I said this was so important is because if you get really good at unit analysis, you can basically construct any equation by just recognizing how the units are gonna behave.